Good morning and welcome to Breakfast with Brian. I'm Brian Barolo. I'm outside of Philadelphia in the mid-Atlantic part of the United States. And today is Wednesday, November 28th. Uh, today it's a cold day, very cold, very windy, to the point where I don't even want to go out, but I have to take care of a couple of things. So anyway, Breakfast with Brian, Darren Bruce, good morning. Um, we're getting started today. Today we're going to be talking about Preston and Steve's Camp Out for Hunger. Now they are part of WMMR 93.3 FM. You can go online. Hey, Ryan, both you guys are up. What are you guys down there today? Um, anyway, for anybody who's not familiar with uh, WMMR 93.3, and uh, you can go online and you can stream them. 93.3 FM or WMMR.com or PrestonandSteve.com. You can get there, and what they're doing is they're doing a camp out for hunger. I've been... I've done it for the first, I don't know how many years, and this is the third year I have not done it. Uh, since I left the company, I'm not there anymore. And some of my guys, my friends are headed down there right now. Darren is uh, on his way down there right now. And good luck, Darren. You got a, uh, a wedding going on. And I don't know how they always have somebody going down now, because what I used to do is to set it up and leave it be, and they would run it. So. Things change. Time goes on. People are less efficient, so therefore they need to supply manpower to babysit or whatever. Got you, Darren. Anyway, Mike Snyder, how you doing? Craig, Kate, everybody's uh, popping on right now. First time watching, Craig? Cool, man. Look, I just hang out. I do breakfast, and I chat about something. So anyway, okay, so we're going to talk a little bit more about that, but I'm going to get started on my breakfast. First thing I do as a human being is I drink and finish my water from the night before. So it's the first thing I put into my body. So a little bit of water. Cheers to you. And I like to think about that drinking the water. I can feel it come down. and It almost feels like it washes the inside. So I consider drinking water. First thing in the morning, first thing in the day, first thing you put in your body, it is the essence of life. Water kind of is like an internal shower for all your organs. Anyway, it's that simple. So um, I made my juice the other day. I have some leftover juice here. I'm going to put that right into my cup. It's a good creamy juice. I like it. It was really, really good. And I just use the basic fruits that I have, whatever I have in my house. And I had apples, oranges, pineapple, and banana. And there's my juice. Okay, I also do my supplements. I do a Centrum Silver multivitamin, and I do turmeric. It's a turmeric and curcumin uh, supplement. And turmeric and black pepper is the actual mix that I need for the turmeric to really work in my body for, uh, for arthritis. Okay, so there you go. Cheers. My two supplements. I'm almost 60 and I'm on zero meds. That's how healthy I am. Mm. Killer juice, killer juice. Okay, I was going to go down to Preston and Steve's Camp Out for Hunger today and hang out, but I know, <clears throat> I know that when I do breakfast with Brian, it's because I'm doing breakfast. And I've been to Preston and Steve. I was started out years ago at King of Prussia. End up up here at Verizon Xfinity. I mean, the Xfinity building up in Philadelphia by the uh, stadiums. It's, uh, yeah, the Xfinity building. So anyway, I've been there for many years. I haven't gone for the last few, but their breakfast is whoever brings breakfast in, whether it's Dunkin' Donuts or a cafe or some other restaurant. They always get food brought to them, pretzels and so forth. and I'd say 99.9% .9 of the time that I've gone, I cannot eat their breakfast because it's got wheat or it's breads that I can't eat or it's got cheese or dairy. So I thought about it, and if I went down there to do my breakfast with Brian there at the Camp Out for Hunger, it would be nice. It would be fun. I'd say hi to Rodney and some of the other guys, but I can't eat there, so... I'm doing my breakfast with Brian at home, but I'm promoting Camp Out for Hunger. Camp Out for Hunger, you can donate food. This has become, has grown 
to being the largest food donation uh, event in the country. So check it out. You should go online. You can donate. You can donate money. You can go to Acme. You can buy a bag. You can go down there and drop it off. They have all kinds of events going on the whole time the shows goes on, and even during the day when the other DJs come on, even into the evening. I'm going to turn it up a little bit. I'm going to start to get my eggs ready. Uh, right now, uh, they're giving the uh, the uh, traffic report right now. So what I'm going to do for breakfast for me today is I am going to take a pan. And I'm going to take a little bit of oil, put it in the pan, and I'm going to make myself some ham and eggs. Very simple. I have some jack ham. It's just imported, imported ham, just regular ham. I just take a couple of slices of this. I throw it down. I think I'm going to do three today. I'm feeling a little bit on the meatier side, and I'm going to turn. Go so on and start cooking. I'm going to throw a couple eggs on there, and it's that simple. You have breakfast? I do have breakfast every day. I may not do this show every day, but I have breakfast every day. Breakfast is, is the most important meal of every day. If you have breakfast, great. If you don't, you don't. Everybody's a little bit different. Everybody finds their ways to get through their day. So, okay, so let me get a lid. So I can cook my eggs up. Let the ham just heat up a little bit before I crack the eggs in there and see what else is going on. So let me see uh, who else is popping on here because two of my friends I used to work with, Darren Bruce and Ryan Ward, are heading down right now to, or Darren's heading down, I don't know if Ryan is, down to the Camp Out for Hunger probably for some lighting cues and stuff uh, and what have you. But anyway, hey, Bill Marion, how's it going? And Leela and Dan Stevenson and Julie, how you doing? Good morning, everybody. Uh, yeah, I'm getting up again. Started. Hey, Dave's nowhere, man. <laughs> Not there, man. I like that. That was really good. Anyway, okay. My ham is uh, cooking away. I'm gonna take a couple eggs, crack them right on top, and be done. Okay, my eggs are in. I'm good to go. So uh, I'm having eggs and ham and some juice and my vitamins. Very simple, and then I'll have to go walk my dog and take care of a couple other chores and get back on the computer and so on and so on. I'm not going down to camp out for hunger this morning. Um, they are doing a wedding for uh, I don't know how many couples today. It, probably in about a half an hour, an hour. Um, you can tune in and listen. They have a lot of things going on, a lot of interviews, a lot of comedy, a lot of music. It's really cool. So while my eggs are cooking, I'm going to turn it up. We can listen to Preston, Steve, and Casey, and Kathy, and, uh, and Nick. So right now they're doing an interview. It's a live event that's going on right now. And if you like to donate, stop. Grab some food, canned foods, whatever, and bring them down and donate. It makes you feel really good here in the heart. So it's part of sharing some love and some. So here we go, I'm listening. Remember they need a onesie for each one of us. Yes, oh, that's right. Whatever it is, I don't know. You guys are very good. So I have your t-shirt on. Thank you. 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 They give away prizes just for giving away prizes. This girl just won a $50 gift card from Wawa. So if you want to go and hang out, you have a minute, you want to donate, go on down. Right down to the stadiums, down right next to the uh, Xfinity building. It's a giant tent, camp out for hunger. They just ask for a donation. So it's, it's a fun show. Uh, They're so doing things right, and doing things for people. We'll start taking place with the wedding. We're aiming to get it done around 8.15, so 
Uh, we'll check on the status of all that. If we have some friends that are involved, I'll make sure we get all the thank yous. We have some special prizes that are going to be happening. I was pointing out in the back there if I didn't change the So they're doing a mass wedding today. I don't know how many couples. 20? Signs of wedding and matrimonial bliss occurring here at this amazing tent, which for all intents and purposes, no pun intended, is a wedding tent. You know, yeah, that's what it is today. Yeah, right. Hey, by the way, I got this email. I wanted to mention this, and uh, this has become a tradition here at the. Uh, uh, at the Camp of Hunger, it says, uh, Hi, my name is uh, Jared Moser. I'm a cadet with the Temple University Army ROTC program. Like last year, Temple's Red Diamond Battalion will be marching five and a half miles from our campus to the Xfinity Life Center uh, Wednesday morning to drop off the canned goods that we've collected for the Camp of Hunger event. And they carry them, by the way. Yes, they do. So, did you hear this? This is the Temple marching band. They're going to march from Temple all the way down to. Xfinity Live to Camp Out for Hunger, and they're carrying their food and walking five miles to get there this morning. They're doing it now. This is a big, big, big event. It's, I almost wish I never left, but I had to move on with myself. And I did, did them for many years, I don't know, seven, eight, nine, ten years maybe. And it was good. Really good. I really felt good to do it. Those are all canned goods, and uh, wow. I have a one. So the Eagles. Uh, they got in touch with us a week or two ago, and uh, it's a really cool looking truck. So they were inviting people out to come check it out if they want to. So the Eagles have a dump truck that they use for waste, for getting it all out of the stadium and everything else. Well, they cleaned the truck all up real nice, and they had a, a food drive, and they filled up the truck, this dump truck, with food, canned food. And they brought the truck over to Camp Out for Hunger. So that's a truckload. A food that the Eagles donated just just it's that's that easy. It's just incredible what they do. They have bikers last night that came by, dropped off food. It's incredible. So if you have a chance, you can donate money, so you can donate food, you can go online, you can uh, stop down, hang out, you can see a wedding this morning, you can they have food, they have coffee, it's it's incredible. Preston and Steve's Camp Out for Hunger. I almost wish I never left, but, you know, I'm moving on with my life, and they're still growing, and I can always volunteer and help, but help uh, out any time I want. But they're still doing it. It's incredible. I'm really, really glad and happy for them. I may go down there tomorrow. Hit the company cafe, got my breakfast. Oh, Julie was at the uh, company cafe and got her breakfast. Awesome. Merle, how you doing? Sheila, Ralph, Mitchell, everybody's here this morning. We camp out for hunger. We're donating food to President Steve's camp out for hunger to help them raise food. It's it's incredible. Okay. My eggs are done. And I'm ready to get them right off the pan and uh, start eating. There's my ham and eggs. Very easy. <clears throat> you got my plate. And my fork. So this goes on all morning for the Preston Steve show, and then it'll go into whatever other DJs come out today. It'll probably be Pierre Robert does his there, and uh, some of the other DJs will go there. They have shows all day. They have shows at night. They do comedy show. It's a full week, and Preston and Steve, they actually camp out on site. They get a, uh, a you know, camper donated, and the tent, everything's donations. I even had gotten the lighting and the uh, video stuff uh, years ago donated from the company I used to work for, Light Action. Uh, Scott Humphrey and Light Action was good enough to donate lighting and production material, staging and video walls and curtains and all kinds of stuff to help make this show happen. And it's been going on for years. I'm really glad I caught it, got them into it, and it's just going well. It's really good. See, Phil Abundance is the receiver of all the foods, and they distribute food out to all the people who are hungry. So these guys, they 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 raise, I don't know, what was it, 1.8 million pounds or something last year. I don't know how many tractor trailers. It's just incredible. It's incredible. So I'm probably going to stop down either later today or tomorrow or Friday and do my little donation and say hi to everybody, and maybe we'll take a couple of snapshots or whatever. But anyway, here we go. Breakfast with Brian. We're trying to help President Steve and camp out for hunger and help them raise awareness and food 
fulfill abundance for people out there that are starving that need food and need help. Here at Breakfast with Brian, we just have our breakfast, which I just made. I'm going to eat it before it gets too cold, so I'm going to do my quick little thing. Ten things that we're thankful for, grateful for, happy for today. Today. So if you get some food and you go down to Preston Steve's Camp Out for Hunger, you're going to be happy that you donated some food. That you're going to help feed a few hungry mouths. That's a good thing. So that's just one thing today. I'm glad I woke up. I'm glad my back is not hurting. I'm glad I got wood in the fire and the fire is going already. I'm happy that uh, I'm, I'm able to share Camp Out with Hunger with some people here. I'm happy for all these good things. You know, so you pick out 10 things today that you're happy or grateful for, or thankful for today. Okay, then also pick three people. I say three, but you can do a lot more. Pick three people and share a little love with them. Wish them a great day, a happy day, a beautiful day, a wonderful day. It's that easy. You just give good positive comments and compliments to people and you share that little bit of love. It kind of inter tangles with each other, you know, intermingles. It it's, uh, intertwines with each other. It's, you know, to give positivity off is sharing some love. It sort of works hand in hand. So I pick three people and I want to wish them a great day. Very simple. Have a great day. That kind of shares a little bit of love, you know, and that's good. And you can do that all day long and you can do it with lots and lots of people. You can do it with 10, 20, 30, 40 people. It doesn't matter. It depends how many people you see and how open you want to be, how positive you want to be, and how much love you want to share. Piece of cake. Share love with three people. Very easy. Next thing is the people within your household. It's such a tight little community. Share one to two positive comments or compliments. Maybe before they leave for work or, and then again when they get home. It's simple. Honey, your dress looks wonderful. You know, you look awesome today. You're going to tear it up. You know what I mean? Little compliments like that. It just, it, it helps. Your kids go to school. All right, you got all your books. Everything looks good. Your hair is all combed. You're looking great. You're going to tear it up. Your kids are going to be jealous. Whatever it might be. Simple. Ten things that you're happy for or help you get happy today. Share some love with like three people and then positive compliments to people within your household. It's that simple. Again, here, it's cold out there. Dress warm. It's windy. Keep your hats on. But if you get a chance, donate to Preston and Steve's Camp Out for Hunger. It's really, really important. This is sharing. This is sharing a little bit of love. It's keeping positivity. It's doing something that's going to make you happy today. And go again tomorrow. And do it again tomorrow. And do it again Friday. If you can get down there, go down there. They're giving prizes out and massages and there's free food. You can't beat it. All right? So I really appreciate everybody coming by today. And if you get a chance, donate. It's a good thing. It's a really good feeling. And don't forget, Preston and Steve's Camp Out for Hunger is going on right now. You can catch it live right now on WMMR 93.3 FM. All right? Check it out. You can go online and get it. You can get it on the radio. If you're not in the area, you can stream it. If they're live, online, and streaming. I use my Alexa to stream uh MMR. Alexa, uh, she's not plugged in. <laughs> I haven't plugged it last night. So anyway, but anyway, WMMR 93.3, Preston and Steve's Camp Out for Hunger. Do it, do it, do it. You'll feel good. Thank you very much, everybody. I really appreciate you stopping by. And Bob, how's it going? Good to see you. And Mitchell, awesome. All right, you all take care now. And uh, I, donate. It's a really good thing. It helps tremendously. And you all have a great, wonderful, happy, positive day. All right, y'all take care now. We'll talk to you soon. Ciao.